In this short video, I would like to show you how the OSM query toolbox works. First of all, you need to define a tag. There are several tags already impl implemented here, and I would like to search for shops and which kind of shops, of course, not alcohol, but we are interested in bakeries. And as we already know, the region we would like to look at, uh, which is Northumberland, uh, I will use your geocode region, but you can also choose define simple bounding box and design whether or not to choose the current display extend or whatever. This works only with uh, the EPSG 4326 uh, coordinate reference system, which is WGS84 and the normal latitude longitude values. But as said, I would like to geocode a region and therefore I'm using Northumberland. Let's have a look how many data points we do have there. Well, we do get here the Overpace API query, which is always a good way to simply copy paste uh, into the Overpace API uh, front end online. There's also the Nominatum uh, URL you could use if you don't find any regions or uh, geocode results for your region and now we do see that there are or that there are already some point information inside the uh, response and we will add each field to the point shape file which is distributed uh, with the data oh, well there it's the point shape file was already created and now there's also a polygon shape file which is created, that means that uh, there was a way in the data set, so uh, an element with the type way in the data set, and this way has nodes where the node, or the first node is exactly the same as the last node, so the system knows that this is a polygon and not only a shapefile. So let's have a look here into the polygons, and uh, let's use this one here, which is a bakery zoom to the layer or oh, only a house or something like that and um, which is somewhere in your Newcastle open tire I think a new begin by the sea but there are also some other bakeries here you can easily see in the attribute table so there are 27 bakeries in Northumberland and um, you can see the whole attributes in the attribute table. So thank you very much for watching.